you know, he's had, uh, I think, eight starts, seven starts, eight starts. And um, the first six, we didn't score any runs for him. We scored 13 runs, and he could have won easily two of those games. Um, he lost one two to one, one three to two, or he won the game three to two, but did not get the win. His last start, he was outstanding. Um, the first six innings against Tampa, he was outstanding. Um, but I've been really encouraged, and, and I think he's pitched better than the numbers indicate. Sometimes it's the other way. They haven't pitched as well as the numbers indicate. But I definitely think CeCe's pitched better than the numbers indicate. One of the things that he's talked about since spring training is that he's got to pitch inside, which sometimes when you don't have the velocity that you've had in previous times might be a tough bridge to cross. How have you seen him adapt to doing that more? Well, I, I think he's just really worked at it. He's you know, pitched righties inside a lot. He's pitched lefties inside. And whenever you're able to do that, it opens up the outer half much more. When guys can hang out over the plate and not worry about one half of the plate, it's usually a recipe for disaster. So to me, you, you know, unless you're throwing really, really hard and you have a wipeout wipe breaking ball, you better use both sides of the plate. Well, I think it's a great opportunity. So many of us get our opportunities when somebody gets hurt in the game um, and you try to make the most of it and what you hope is that the person that comes up doesn't press and say oh, this is only going to be my only opportunity the young man's talented we all we all know that so the big thing for us is to get him to relax and just show us what you can do